This restaurant in Pompeii is about 2,000 years old. It may be ancient, but in many ways resembles a modern-day fast food business. The L-shaped counter has holes for containers to serve hot food and frescoes that advertise items on the menu. And like most successful businesses, it had a prime location. The building was found by this team of archaeologists during a mission to shore up Pompeii's ruins. We started excavating two years ago. At first, we only found a side of the bar which, among other things, has a beautiful painting of a Nereid riding a seahorse. I think it's a homage to the nearby fountain because it's located in a small city square that's among the most evocative in Pompeii. There is a fountain, a piezometric tower, a water tank and many other structures. Among the findings, a range of paintings that include a cockerel, ducks and a dog. The vibrant colours remain intact, notably Pompeii red to highlight the eatery's features. The menu is thought to have included dishes ranging from snails to paella. Traces of food from goats to fish were found inside terracotta jars, along with fava beans used to add flavour to wine. Animal bones were also uncovered and cooking utensils that could have been used today. This adds to Italy's rich history. There are hundreds of archaeological sites in lesser-known parts of the country that could attract cultural tourism of millions of people from all over the world. Pompeii was buried by a volcanic eruption in 79 AD near present-day Naples. The city is now a source of archaeological history and treasures and an example of what life was like back then. Over several years, about 80 fast food joints have been found in the city, but this one is the first to be entirely excavated and restored and soon to be open to the public. And archaeologists say there are many more to come. Rahila Mohammed, Al Jazeera.